Hi, hello, it's Pip here from CreamHoopCurls.com. Thanks for joining me today. Today I'm just giving you a little sneak uh, peek. Well, it's not a sneak peek actually, because my, my retreat has already come and gone. I'm giving you the lowdown on the pillow gifts that I gave this year at my spring retreat. So when everyone uh, comes along and they check into their room, this was the this was the pillow gift that was on their pillow waiting for them. It's one of our... Uh, mini silver gable boxes and um, the stamp set that we're using in retreat everyone's getting uh, the bundle the petite the petal palette bundle uh, so this is from the stamp set this is using elegant eggplant because I love elegant eggplant and it's uh, retiring uh, and in there 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 was or there there is I'll just open it up again these do seal really well. So inside there, there's some of our scrunchy, uh, like that. Uh, there was some sweeties, some chocolate. I didn't have enough to to put as many in my in my display one as they got in theirs. Um, so yeah, sweeties, chocolates, and a little sewing kit, um, which was actually used for one of the projects. So. <laughs> That was kind of like a, okay, I'm coming to a hotel and I'm getting a sewing kit. Don't I get a sewing kit normally when I stay at a posh hotel? You do, but this is this is for uh, additional purposes. This was for the retreat purposes, so no project purposes. So yeah, so that was in the room. That's what they got in the room. And then on Saturday morning, they got this little box, which again is, this is one of our pizza boxes some designer series paper uh, then I cut out I, I stamped and I cut out the big rose uh, design from the from the stamp set and then I heat embossed I just love you on black with with, with uh, white stamp embossed powder and punch that out using the classic label punch and in there was a reel of the organza ribbon so that was their Saturday morning. Uh, and they, all their pillow gifts basically contain items that they're going to use in the next set of projects uh, as, as kind of top ups to what they get in their goodie bag. And then so Saturday afternoon, we went gold. I love these gold treat bags. Again, with some of the organza ribbon, the thank you, the little flowers from the stamp set, this time using the um, everyday label punch. And then inside, bling, always good to have a bit of bling. So that was Saturday afternoon. And obviously they could then go back and add bling if they wanted to to their Saturday morning projects. It was entirely up to them. Then Sunday was slightly different uh, because uh, I just decided to change it up this year. So they all got one of these uh, letters, not just a random letter. They got their, their initial, their first name initial. Uh, and it's an MDF, just an MDF letter, 13 centimetres high, just in case you were wondering. Uh, and on top of that, they all had attached to it somewhere, depending on the size of the letter, um, a, one of the little birds from the set. And they were all coloured in differently in a Stampin' Blend colour. So they got these in the morning and I told them all to keep their little birds handy. And then... Around lunchtime-ish, we did a prize patrol and everybody got the colour blend that went with their little birdie. So that was quite interesting. Who's got light? Who's got dark? <laughs> Who's got Bermuda Bay versus Pool Party? That <laughs> came up with some quite interesting conversations. But yes, yeah, so they all had that. So in their bags, they, they already got two of the stamping blends, the um, Daffodil Delight light and the Old Olive light. So this was just to add an additional colour to their collection um, that they could use on their projects. So yeah, that was that was our little pillow gift. I like to show them off to you because I know everyone wants to know what happens at retreat. So I always like to give pillow gifts. It's a tradition that Stamping Up have started. You know, that that's where it comes from. When you go on the incentive trips, um, if you earn them, then... They absolutely nail the gift giving, uh, but even at on stage, centre stage, they give us gifts. On stage, they give you um, prize patrol and uh, gifts in your bag, and so it's you know it's part of this of the whole stamping up experience. And whilst my retreats are Queen Pip card retreats, 
I also like to just share the love and uh, give a few extra extra goodies um, for them to use and for them to enjoy. And I take great pleasure in making all of the little gifts for them and thinking out what I can get them for the next retreat. And I'm already thinking now what I can get at Christmas because, of course, I have to now think about the next one <laughs> and um and it's you know can I better what I did last year can I do something different what am I going to do for projects this year how will it all work so it's part of the fun for me for designing my retreat is the deciding on what I'm going to do for the little projects for them and for the little gifts and I added in extra colors here that we didn't use during retreat just so that they could see that the stamp set that they got could be used with other things as well and so they're not limited to the colours that I have designed for them in their classes. So there you go. That's what we get at retreat. So if you would like to book a place on retreat, you can just head over to www.queenpipcards.com and you can have a look under classes for my craft retreat. There's a big button down the side or there's a link in my menu and you can have a look and see what um, what we've got available. There are spaces for the second weekend in October at the moment first weekend's fully booked but there are spaces in the second so if you're interested you can come along and, um, and then of course there's always next year uh, for spring so check out the website have a look and in the meantime I hope you've enjoyed the inspiration of other things that you can do with the petal palette suite all right thanks for watching take care now see you soon bye